pretty steep though. That was dumb. Hey, welcome back to the channel. I'm here at Sugar Mountain. First day of the year for me here at Sugar, so I'm gonna keep it a little tame and go on the Green Circle Trail. And this one is actually a green circle. So if you're a beginner, you wanna try out downhill mountain biking for the first time, this is the trail to do it. It's called Carolina Cruiser here at Sugar Mountain. Let's ride. All right, as I start Carolina Cruiser, it's important to know how sweet the lift situation is here at Sugar Mountain because they load your bikes for you and unload them. The Beach Mountain, <laughs> you're like sprinting to put your bike on the rack. It can be kind of tricky. Anyway, so here's Carolina Cruiser. It's pretty choppy um, throughout, so that's something to know. And a lot of the jumps, you actually don't want to try to bother with because uh, they're really short and like straight up like this, and this, and this. You really want to soak a lot of it up. There are some sweet jumps, but they're probably like a third of the ones you see. So don't try to get crazy and jump everything. Like that could throw you. But after this turn, you start getting some pretty cool ones that you can. Whew, not that. Not that. Well, here we go. Like this. And this. So there's like, yeah, four in a row. So that's a pretty cool way to end the first section of this trail. Okay, the second section of this trail is the best. It starts off with two jumps that are fun to hit. <laughs> you can really get some nice air on those. Then you kind of traverse and hit some more jumps, oh. including a tabletop. Oh. And then it starts to become more like Burmese Python, a trail at Beach Mountain, where it's just fun, roller coaster and getting up high on the berms pays dividends in terms of fun this part's super choppy and you want to soak all these up but then back to the fun <laughs> that will throw you This is awesome. This is what bike park riding is all about. And then you get to the end of part two. So part three begins with this beautiful view, but it's actually kind of a lame part of the trail. A lot of people bypass it to get on the blue square trail called Rally Alley, because what you're doing is basically just traversing this field a lot, you know? Which uh, is actually the ski trail called Oma's Meadow, which is my favorite ski trail in North Carolina. But as far as biking, it's a little bit weird, especially, I mean, it's just freshly mowed here. But sometimes when it isn't, uh, there's some little potholes that can sneak up on you, so. When you're in the wide open space, you think you can kind of just send it. Uh, but you do still want to be careful here. It's pretty uneven. Woo! That was rattly. Anyway, we cross over from the far side of the mountain to the all the way to the other side. Uh, this part's pretty cool. A little berm, some rocks to jump off. Oh yeah. And then you just open it up here for a little bit. And there is actually a section of berms here that begins with a fun little shoot. <laughs> Woo! All good? Yeah. All right. 
How you doing? And yeah, these berms are sweet. Yeah. Pretty steep though. Camera probably doesn't show it, but these feel like straight down. So when you get to the easy street lift, this is what I'm calling the end of part three. So the last part, part four, as we finish off the 1200 vertical feet of downhill, is just kind of open field riding. Nothing too special, it's just kind of getting you down to the lift. But you can go real fast here. Just beware of the little divots that do appear from time to time. Breaking bumps and things like that. I'll try to get a wide stance. Yosemite Sam it a little. Yeah, so you can lean the bike over a little bit more. And not just hang off the back, but ooh. Anyway, that was Carolina Cruiser. The, the Green Circle Trail and really probably the easiest lift access bike park trail in North Carolina. So it's a great litmus test if you do it and you're freaked out, do it again. But, you know, if you do it three times and it's still beyond your level of comfort, then it's time to keep practicing. Cheers, till the next round.